Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. I'm your host, Mr. Mokalabra, and right now, as we can see on screen, the Dredgers, well, we did really well with them. And really, it's not no longer the Dredgers' territory. It's pretty much our territory here. So, here are the Kalshis. Actually, Kalshis are not that high. Their divisions obviously don't have a lot of manpower in them, but as soon as we get to the next day, they are gone. But we got some scrap bots, which is pretty nice, and a few more guns, which will help out when we're trying to pacify this area. So, we can either go to war with Broken Coast, Wizard of Camel, Silex Nation, or Bellingham. Let's go with... Uh, how many guns do we not have? We don't have a lot of guns, which means we're going to need a lot of, a little bit of time to get up to outside of battalions. So, yeah. We'll see what happens next. We're currently doing infrastructure developments. Up here. We should also develop our infrastructure to make it safer for civilians to move around the nation and decrease resource extraction. Road building, we lose some caps, two infrastructure, one civvies. Um, these are all exactly the same, which is okay. It's not great. So I guess road building, I suppose. Building roads in our territory will increase supply and lay the foundations for future economic developments. However, this will cost us, of course, some money. Which is unfortunate, but whatever. We're going to need more money. Um, honestly, I just want to go to war with these guys. There is a hole over there, too. Um, just because after we go to war with these guys, hopefully we'll get more factories. More uh, compliance, of course. More manpower. More stuff to use. And then just go to town with them. Plant cultivation will be nice. Get some more output. It's a little bit ahead of time, but that's okay. We've got some comms to go through as well. And, yeah, not bad overall. Not bad overall. How much political power do we get every day? 1.78 is not enough. That's pretty good. How many um guns do we need? 55. Ooh. Do we have an intelligence agency? No, we do not. Well, might as well create one. What is What says monarchy here? That doesn't scream monarchy. Follows, if you like to read about followers of the apocalypse, please go right ahead. Uh, yeah, we might as well come, out, come on in. Let's see. Rockets? No, no. Stop. Oh, we'll choose the sword. The sword of the monarchy. Something like that. Something like that. Cool. Hope you guys are having a pretty good day. Right now, we have quite a bit of resistance going up. In some areas, actually, it's already going down. 27, 43% compliance is not bad. 9% is not very good. 26% uh, is not bad. So, we'll see what happens very soon. And you know what? Just go outside of battalions already. It's fine for now. Road building one. Followed up with road building two, probably. Because we want more civvies. Building roads in our territory will increase supply and lay foundations for future economic developments. Our will cost us money, which is exactly the same thing as that other one. So, oh well. Construction? Yes, please. Now, could we win if we actually do go to war with these guys? That's my question. How many divisions do they have? Camlo. Not a lot, a lot of manpower. They're about, about the same as us, actually. Hmm. Well, let's give it a little bit of time first. Let's get some more compliance here first. This way, um, when we do go to war, we want it to do with resistance and lowered uh, stability and stuff like that. So, if I need your kids, let's grab some of this too. That'd be good. And I want to wait to get this one done just because I don't want to have a bad issue with that. So, it's just for here. Watch out for spies. We don't have that many civvies to work with right now, but it's fine. It's fine. Refugees. We could do new systems care package, but... That would help a little bit, actually. Do we need more money for anything else? What else do we need? Oh, we all broken kills. Well, that'd probably be smarter for us to go to war with them first, so we can perform Cascadia. Uh, close out of that one. Close out of that one. How many divisions do they have? Ooh, that's quite a few. Hmm. Yeah, we might want to actually want to go to war with them first, then. And that would be the smarter thing to do. Of course, leaving our... Home Island, completely undefended, probably is not a smart idea to do. How much? How big is our navy? Oh, it's a big navy. Oh, it's not good. Yeah, that navy could really struck our own. So, yeah, it's not good. Let me do a view, Spec Ops. It's very nice. Um, it's over here, too. It's probably really a bad idea going to war with them. Probably really, really, really bad idea. Five days left, though, which is pretty good, so. Everyone about Secret Milo, please go right ahead. Cool. Oh, there we go, nice. Um, heavyweight, might as well. And help us put down some resistance. There we go. Watch out for spies. Oh, any parts and stuff, thank you. And what else? Uh, this stuff is all okay. It's always all just okay. non core mapper would be nice. War support, yeah. But we'll just fight War Gold's time, type position. Recruitable population. I'm mean, thinking actually we might go up to four year conscription. Yeah. So let's see what happens. Ooh, and actually. Yeah, don't worry about that, guys. Just go home. Just go home first. 
If we were to attack, would we be able to win? Now, they're attacking our lines pretty fiercely. But if we were to go in as well, just go into them as best you possibly can. Which sounds really weird to say, out of context, but whatever. And you guys go into here too. That'd be really good. Oh, hello. Well, they might be naval invading us. My bad. But luckily, we've got some of you guys here. And we lost the capital. God dang it. Oh, New Victoria lost. That sucks. All right, so that was my fad. My fad. My bad. Um, I knew something like this would happen. So this is why we're gonna hit them pretty hard uh, up north. They attack us. We attack them. Road building, please. Thank you. Thank you. Hopefully, we can crush our armies. Hopefully, our divisions are stronger overall compared to theirs. Division for division, we should do a little better than they are. So we'll see. Um, conscripts, traders, chief of the air force. Yeah, I'll go for conscription just in case. It's fine. We're, we're gonna need that manpower. We're really gonna need it. How are we doing down here? Doing okay? Come over here. Help out. Eugene Hayes. Learn, 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 learn. Man, we're slowly winning around here. Lost quite a few guys, but whatever. Yeah, I don't understand. Division for division? They might have anti-tank. But how are we not winning here? That's my question. How do we lose there and lose here? Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't like playing in this area of old, in old World Blues. It's just, it's so, kind of sometimes just crummy fighting here. But if we can go into here, that'd be great. Yeah, yeah, maybe I made a mistake. So, I'm going to wait a little bit before we go to war with them again. Alright, everyone, so now it's 2280, and this has been quite a bit ahead of time from where we last, last left off. I'll be honest, I use cons commands. You literally cannot take out Broken Coast because they're way too tough for New Victoria. Like, even industry-wise, they... Broken Coast had like 56 factories. We had like 30, maybe? Um, this is not fun. It's just not fun. I hated pretty much every second of this. Actually, I took out Camo first just because I was bored. Apparently, the Silex Nation is now war them as two as well, but like, this is just not fun. The Broken Coast, at least in relation to New Victoria, if you want, if the mod developer wants New Victoria to be strong, you've got to work on Broken Coast and nerf them a little bit, because it, because if you don't know, Broken Coast uses 30 combo with divisions. So when we're using 20 combo with divisions, or even 10, we get blown out so hard that I use cons commands, and it's just not fun. Just not fun. I don't see the point of playing New Victoria with this mod at all if <laughs> Broken Coast does not get nerfed or new victory gets buffed a little bit more because i wouldn't say this tree is unbalanced at least the way we went it just wasn't a lot of fun it's just not a lot of fun but resource uh, scavenging one we should explore territory to see if we can uncover any resources which can be exploited for equipment production and trading so yeah broken coast either needs a nerf or new victoria actually really does need a buff because you just can't compete you just can't compete. But our victory against the Raiders of the Broken Coast has emboldened our people. Across the ways of the Northwest settlers, traders, and wastelanders appreciate our efforts made to bring safely to this land. The time is right that we take advantage of the swell of support and declare a new nation focused on protecting the rights of those living within our lands. So, I actually had to acquire some of this territory already. So, I don't know. Just That's why I didn't show you the wars. And Campbell wasn't that bad. It wasn't great. It really was not great at all. But it wasn't that bad. But Cascadia, the birthright. All of Columbia is ours. After all these years, Cascadia is won. We must formally announce the creation of a unitary Cascadian state and spread it worldwide, or around the world. But yeah, it just wasn't fun. I'll, I'll be completely honest, it was not fun, and I definitely, if I play this mod again ever, I would like to see a buff to New Victoria, because they, they need it. They, they have to get one. It's just not fun. It's just, mmm. Was not fun at all, trying to fight god-awful Broken Kills, because they're buff. They have bonuses to attack and defense. And on core territory and 30 combo with you, you're not going to make it. Straight up, not going to make it. So, I do apologize, but I'd rather be honest than not honest. I'd use cons commands. Sucks. Not fun. Um, at least we switch things around. Old World Treasures. We've uncovered some advanced resources which can be exploited and used for producing sophisticated technology and weaponry. Before the war, Vancouver Island was home to a tidal power plant, which we've recently discovered. While it's now rusted and long abandoned, the recent infrastructure developments and new resources we've uncovered can be used for the restoration efforts. Not bad. And we have 20 count with infantry, man. And these guys are generally 
pretty darn good. Like, we don't get any attack bonuses or buffs, do we? Um, we got a little bit, but that's not very much. Yeah, I'm on. Yeah. This attack and defensive core territory means nothing. It really means absolutely literally nothing. So, that's not good enough, in my opinion. It's not good enough. Then again, I'm not the best way 4 player, but it's not enough. If you want to be successful here, like especially against Broken Coast, the manpower advantage is ridiculous, and the industry advantage is ridiculous, too. So, But maybe that's just me, and I just want to complain a bunch. And over here, as you can see, we're not going to win over here, too, because we don't have enough resources or equipment. And just, I don't know. It just it is what it is, I guess. Uh, yeah, we need more of that stuff, too. We need more grenades, uh, more LMGs. What is that? of a lot of stuff. Cascadia, the birthright. Unification, Cascadia. Word is spreading across the land from caravans, scouts, and scavengers like wildfire. Small island nation, which was once a new Victoria, has unified all of Colombia, which is proclaiming a unitary Cascadian state. Records from before the Great War indicate that Cascadian independence movements were present, present in the U.S. and Canada, but never achieved the goal. Centuries later, the dream has finally become a reality. Interesting. I wish we got something else from that. It doesn't sound like very much fun. So if we wanted to attack. Honestly, we should easily be able to win immediately. But they're attacking us. Go figure. Huh. And we did finish our land auction too, so... You're going to force the attack. I'm not going to play around anymore. Just... If you lose, you lose. You die, you die. I'm perfectly okay if we don't win, then. Like... 30 combo with infantry. And I know the devs don't really have that much control over the AI. But, like... It's not fun. Fighting just gigantic stacks of infantry. And that's pretty much all I had. Just infantry. And some anti-tank, but anti-tank doesn't really concern me too much right now, so... <clears throat> was not fun. It was not fun. Got some money, though. I don't even got another trade note, which kind of sucks, whatever. But some comments included, so... Someone said, also agreed, that the focus tree's okay. It's okay. It could... It could definitely use some expansion. I don't know what the mod developer's intentions are. Maybe someday it'll get an expansion. Maybe not, so... We'll have to wait and see. Maybe the focus tree will change radically and be really cool, really awesome. Especially, you know, pushing out the idea of a monarchy here. Even a parliamentary system here. Uh, constitutional monarchy as well um, for New Victoria. But at the time of this recording, I just can't recommend this mod yet. Especially if you want to reform Cascadia like the way we did. So, <clears throat> in my opinion, it is not balanced enough with, New Victor with uh, Cascadia or Broken Coast. Camo was, like I said earlier, a little difficult too, but not nearly as difficult as uh, Broken Coast. I hate the Broken Coast. I, I don't like fighting up in this region, really. Unless you have power armor, I don't see a point fighting up here. Losses. Two, six, four. Well, at least we're doing better than I did with the other group. My god. I mean, look at all the manpower we have. I'm just sitting here, just absorbing manpower. Yeah, we have enough money to probably keep it going. Suicide pills, not yet. There we go. Help him out a little bit more. Colville, please, thank you. Go all the way. Just keep going. Keep going. You you have air superiority. You have to have air superiority. Yeah, look at that. Nope. Just volatile shack market. And who's not cored? Like, we've cored all this stuff now, which is nice, but still. How are we losing with air superiority? My god, I hate this so much. How are we losing here? Five attack. We have an intel advantage. We are attacking from multiple sides. Don't you dare tell me that we're that we're not winning here. I know infantry sucks, and I don't know why the devs. Why did they ruin infantry? Basically, I don't understand why. Uh, hello. So I don't play old world blues as much as I used to because the meta is just not. I don't like it. I really don't like it that much. At the time of this recording, it might change in the future. Don't get me wrong, it might change, but like. Hmm. Oh. There you go. <clears throat> uh, is there anything else we could do here? No? Alright, Operation Singra. Olympus Oh my god. The Grand Duchy of Washington will be formed. Scrap Shacks? Cool, why not? Just go in. Might as well. Might as well try it. Let them attack us, that's fine. They have no one over here, which is weird. Nope, no loan for you. Rock control gear, let's go over here too. Yeah, but yeah. Fighting those other wars took me so much time off screen. It's not even funny. It just... Mm, disappointed, that's all I can say about it. Are you kidding me? 
All right, just kill them off as fast as you possibly can. I'm not. I'm not gonna bother with that. Our navy is actually okay. Like I, I was actually very surprised. Our navy actually beat up Broken Coast Navy, which was very different from what I'm used to. Incredibly different from what I'm used to. Go in. Go all the way to Bellingham right now. We don't have time for this. And these guys are only attacking just to keep these guys in place, so. Yeah, our navy actually did really surprisingly well. I'm not sure how, but scale level 4. Not bad. Not bad at all. <clears throat> keep going in. Why are you stopping? Oh, we actually pushed over. Look at that. Oh. Huh. <coughs> Having take over, they're done. Losses. Oh. Well. What? Game. No one else is in the war. Just give me all the score. There you go. Uh, so we have the Washington Brotherhood here right now. Is there anything else we could do? The Canadian royalty. Uh, get New Victoria disabled, which is unfortunate, but whatever. Don't really care. Refugees, uh, drastic measures, political actions, no propaganda stuff. Eh, we're probably going to be too bad. Are we still at war? No, we're not. Um, we need more away, more of those. Uh, we're okay on that stuff. Go down by five. We have enough mobile fortific fortifications as well. Get a lot more planes. These pla just loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of planes. Anything else here? What else is out of date? No, nothing. Okay. We want to fight the Washington Brotherhood, I guess. Yeah. Some of these guys died here, huh? All right, not bad. Yeah, I wish it was more to the focus tree as well. Thank you. And you guys come over here. Nice. Economic capital fallen, whatever. Don't really care, to be honest with you. Nope, nope. And you guys come here. The fight against these guys is going to be pretty difficult, probably. But I'll do like this. Me two guys, you guys gotta come over too. And then the guys who are over here, I'm gonna split off just a little bit as well. Yeah, with all this political power, what are we supposed to do? There's not really much we can do with it. Which I'm, you know, I wish we could, but. Better be an economic resurgence there, man. It's not bad money. Okay, I literally stated for two of you guys to go over there. I don't understand why you disobeyed me, but. There we go. Alright, let's see. Anything else? We're doing well there. We're building up a lot of roads. Um, honestly, just build a lot of this stuff up here eventually, too. Massive industrial base in the north, because we have the space for it, right? So, yeah. Uh, still can't recommend this mod. I don't just... It's disappointing. I wish it was a little bit more. But, like I said, there's more development. We'll see. We'll definitely see. We will go to War of the Brotherhood, but I guess we have to manually justify. What? I don't understand why we have to manually justify. There should be something in your focus view where you do go to war with them eventually. So, the Grand Duchy of Washington will be formed. Why do we need to justify? It should be a war goal. Like, it should be a thing in the focus tree. That's, a, that's definitely a missed opportunity. If, especially if you can form the state of Washington. We don't have cores on this either, which... So what are we supposed to do with our PP besides, like, just core stuff? I guess nothing? No, uh, I don't care about that. Um... Motorize, maybe? On a speaker? Yeah, I'll do that one, too. I should have done that one first. My bad. That's my fault there. Uh, basic drill. After basic drill, let's grab some of this. Well, let's say fibers. Not bad. Basic wall pumps. Uh, maybe there's some plane stuff. Yeah, get some monoplane fighters. That'd be good. Well, we're definitely cranking out a lot of ships now. It's kind of nice. Yeah, if we attack, we're going to get just destroyed here. Mmm. Victorian Little Levy. At this point, get some fire teams, get some anti-tank, get some that too. We need them. Which means we're not going to have enough fire teams at all. We actually have enough fortifications, which is a little surprising, but... Fire teams. Uh, go down by one, we got more than enough stuff there. Go down by five, go down... 
by five. Don't really want to lower this amount either, because our industry is not bad. Get some radar here. Get some air bases too. <coughs> that could help make up the difference. As long as we have, like just ground the enemies into dust uh, due to air support and such. There you go. Get two. Take one guy from here. Take two more. Glory Falls. All right. Good to see. Very good to see. Another light cruiser is great. And are these guys almost gone or out? Nope. They are disappointing. Coming out. New field marshal. Uh, Ezra, you can do that. That's fine. And become what? Melee hacker? Oh, yeah, why not? You can become a melee hacker. <clears throat> you. Come over here. Because we just need soldiers for the front. Ranger Doctor's not bad. Some better recovery rate. Grab another general. And do that right there. Alright, not bad. <clears throat> Which means we're going to have to fight the Seraph Lords in the next one. What happened here? Timberline. Go ahead and train as well. I think it'll be beneficial for everybody. If you all trained. Any new planes? We have enough manpower for now. We definitely need more fighters. Holy crap. There you go. Do that too. Um, where are the millies? We need a few millies going on right now. There you go. That won't take too long to do, so. Alright. Uh, we don't need that much manpower. The idea that RxP game wouldn't be too bad, though. We do have a lot of money for it, so. God dang it. You dingus. Whatever we want to, we can't go to war, so. But are the soldiers ready? Honestly, probably not. There's a lot of enemies around here. <coughs> Excuse me. But I'm not too worried about these guys over here. The the front line here, I'm a little worried about. Because we don't have enough fire teams yet. We're working on it pretty darn well, actually. We need to go to war by the 17th, which is not bad. Just death stack in here. As best we possibly can. Oh, hello. Three divisions. Can they really hold out three divisions against them? Hmm. Ah, we're almost out of our death set, which is nice, 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 nice. Castle's looking great. Energy tanks are looking fine. Um, yeah. I wish there was more we could do here with it, but whatever. Intelligence. We got more than enough money. Keep going. Well, doing this is probably a bad idea. Advanced smelter is not bad. Grab some of that. Monoplane fighters. Grab some of that too. And yeah, we make planes pretty darn fast. Nice. Uh, there we go. Get even some more guys just in case. And let's go with this. Or this. Because there's no penalty to research times. The guy's good to go. Well, let's see. If this goes poorly, well. Oh well. <coughs> Actually, how strong are they? A lot of manpower, up to 61 divisions, which we definitely don't have enough of. Probably, I am probably made, just made a mistake here, but whatever. Let's see what happens. Um, holding okay-ish, for the most part, in some of these areas. You've got to cover your bases better than this, stupid fleet. My god. Seriously. I sh we should not have to pull out soldiers like this. Oh my god. Okay, where, where the hell is the fleet? What the hell are you doing? Oh my god, split. Well, we lost New Victoria again. God dang it. This piece of garbage fleet. I mean, we tried the best we can here. Look at that. So stupid. You guys are going to go in immediately and kill them off. I'm not going to tolerate just losing stuff here. Oh, look. Yeah, destroy their entire fleet. Let's all go to our fleet is. It's, it's very surprising that our fleet is this good. And since they're so sending soldiers in any ways, we might as well do this too. Well, it could be a lot worse than I thought it could be. It could be a lot worse. Oh, look at that. Some more combos. Nice. Look at this. We're literally destroying them all right there, which is awesome. 
You should be able to win here. You honestly should 100% be able to win here. Are you kidding me? Are we really going to get encircled here? Holy crap, I am not happy about this. Alright, so we lost these guys. We lost the island. That sucks. Well, what a waste. Which means you guys are going to force the attack. Which means we got to win as fast as possible now. Which means you guys are going out too. I'm sorry for... I'm just. This is just... I could be doing so much better, but... <clears throat> I'm honestly frustrated with this mod. So, yeah, I'm not sure what else we can really do about it. Yeah, we got the operative back. That's good. Has anyone learned anything? No? Oh, we can't even see us now? Oh, man, come on. I want to see how many casualties we've inflicted by just killing them all off. 3,000, not enough. 55 divisions. That's so many divisions. Jesus Christ. You guys, keep going in. Keep going in. Nice. Destroy the entire... Actually, how much time the Navy do they have left? If they try naval invasions, they're going to just get destroyed. Oh, they still got quite a few ships. It's not good for us, but whatever. Air-wise, we gotta be winning. Right? We're doing quite a good amount of damage, right? Nice. You guys keep pushing this way. We're actually doing a lot better than I thought we would. Obviously, we lost New Victoria, which is not good, but whatever. Nice. Keep it up. Capitol Hill has fallen. Nice. Even against power armor, we're doing quite well. Yeah, this is all a distraction. All a distraction. Don't worry about it. You see nothing. Fall of Shady Sands. Goodbye, Shady Sanarinos. For the most part, it's still green around here, which is pretty nice. I wish we could see how close they are to capitulating. That'd be great to see. Bayou motor is gone. Up and out. Out and out. Anyone else got upgrades? No, no. Hey, Capitol Hills. Yes, go, go for it. Go for it. Go for it. You're literally... You have to win here. You can pierce their armor. That's unacceptable if you cannot win right here, right now. Eagle Rock, good. Kill that power armor off. And keep sinking everything they got. Any convoys they got, just destroy them. Once we get some more ships, I'm going to make uh, another task force, so that'll be good. Guys, yeah, can you keep going on? I know they got a lot of divisions, but you know what? So do we. Keep going in, keep going in, keep going in. Hey, well, we lost our trade nodes. We took their trade node. I think it's a pretty fair deal. Pretty darn fair deal. You know, I don't like this over here. Guys, keep going. Force the attack. I, we need to win now. They're doing force defense, aren't they? No? Drop their strength like an insane amount. Alright, I don't want to do this again, but we're going to have to. Keep them in place. Just keep them in place for now. I need you guys to move faster than this. This is not good enough. I wish we could see how close they are to capitulation, though. Oh my god, just... That's what I don't like about fighting this Northwest. You just don't have the resources. You don't have enough resources for anything. You try to do well, you just don't have enough resources for anything. Unless you're Broken Coast. And they're just giving a bunch of resources. Hi. Oh, we got three things here. Go for two. There you go. New Vegas downfall. Come on. How are you not winning more? How are you losing? How the heck are you losing? And when we can pierce them and we have intel advantage? I just don't understand. Yeah, I'm sorry. The devs need to fix infantry. They really do. They need to be buffed. Not too much, but just a little bit more. I'm sorry this has turned into just a kind of a complaint, complaining, whiny video, but like... <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what the devs are thinking, man. I know they don't like me, but still... Back Bellevue, just take all the victory points if you can. I'm surprised they haven't tried to invade up here, but then again, they might be out of convoys too. 
Okay, you guys are hurry up, man. Don't let him in. Good, 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 good. Marksmanship. Fort Williamette. You gotta go straight for that right now. You're gonna help support the attack, too. I mean, overall, we're doing pretty decent. Once this area is taken care of, this area will fall apart, too. So that'll be good. Nice. Crack base. Very good, very good. Keep going. I need you guys to keep going. Don't worry about manpower losses. We got 18,000 manpower. Zero issues. Keep encircling and destroying them. Be great. Nice. Fort William at. Go right here. Do not let them move. Nice. Keep going. What are you guys... I don't understand. I I wish Hoi 4. It's not an old world blues thing. But I wish Hoi 4 would like update and it's like, oh, we're going to take attrition when we move here. I don't care. I really don't care. Because in the end, it won't matter. You keep attacking until I say stop attacking. Mm, invest stimulus? No thanks. Not in Seattle. Do that one though. Um, do that one too. There you go. This is looking a lot better. Obviously, this isn't, but whatever. With air superiority. Oh no, we don't have air superiority. Okay, I see what it is now. I'll get one too. Ah. Oh. Come on. My god. Kill these guys up first. What? Why did they go to war with us? What the heck? <laughs> I don't understand it sometimes. I really don't. Can you guys hurry up? My god. Poop out more guys. Because they need help supporting just like controlling those guys over there. Uh, there you go. I guess we probably will need some of this too. There we go. That should be better for that. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? How the hell did you get encircled here? You pieces of garbage. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. I hate the AI. The AI literally cheats. Like, they literally poop out divisions, like, in instantly. Like, that's so completely unfair. I don't know why that's still a thing by Paradox. Like, oh, just let the AI just poop out as many divisions as they want. Why? It's one thing they're like militia or something, but like... Literally just like, just you can throw tank divisions and normal Hoi 4, power armor. I just don't understand why. And I know that... Why do they go to war with us? Why? <laughs> I'm sorry, but this is this has been one crappy episode for me. Like, this is ridiculous. They don't even go to war with the Brotherhood, do they? Please tell me they go to war with the Brotherhood. This should not... Why, why, why us? Why us? Why not the Brotherhood? You're going to force the attack, and you're going to kill every single piece of garbage off here right now. We don't have time for this. Go in there, you ding-dong. They're doing force defense. They've got to be. I mean, that... Why, why did the devs make infantry so weak? I, I'd love an explanation. I know it was too strong earlier, but, like... Why? And how many victory points do we need? My god! <laughs> how many victory points do we need to take these guys out? Seriously! I'm going insane doing this. Thank God you guys got done. Apparently we're going to send you down here because these guys want to kill us off too. <coughs> Scavengers Triumph. Robotics. Can we at least win? Like, seriously. Oh my God. Just kill them off. You can pierce them. They're not that strong. Just don't understand why we need to conquer every single, literally every single victory point here. Just, just take it. For the love of God, just take it. Why is this a... Why? Why is that a victory point too? 
Why? Who designed that? I can't wait till this this nation gets a rework. And we're gonna get this division and circle killed off because Oh my god, how many more? Jesus, I'm sorry guys. I, I, this episode has just been a, a complete wash for me. I apologize. We'll have one more episode out of this so we can actually do well here, supposedly. So, can we at least get this one done? Operation Rose Bay. All the pre-war Washington is under our control. We should establish a duchy to administer these territories. But I gotta end, take a break because this is this is infuriating to me. So, if you enjoyed the video regardless, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when I've cooled off a little bit and get tired and stop bringing up a whole bunch of complaints. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.